right, guys. Today we're gonna try again. We're gonna go try to get my airplane from Conway. So should be a fun flight. We're gonna head um, out of Charleston International again. Same situation as last time. All three of us are gonna fly up. Hopefully gonna fly straight to Walterboro, South Carolina, drop off the plane and fly back. And it is early. My boys are up being weirdos. All right, but before we leave, I found out that my nephew Vincenzo likes watching my YouTube channel. So just wanna say hi, Vincenzo. Ali, you wanna say hi? Yeah. We'll say hi. Hi, Vincenzo, I love you. <laughs> you say hi to Vincenzo? Oh, Vincenzo. He's not gonna say hi. What's up, Vincenzo? Thanks for watching the channel, buddy. Can I say? No, get out of here. Hi. And it is a beautiful morning for a fairy. And luck is already with me because I left my resurgence PPG coffee cup on my roof and it made it all the way down the street without falling off. So, um, solid one. later what's up guys so I am at my buddy Lee's house he slept in um, he set two alarms and slept through them both he told me so um, we're way way behind schedule and that's only a problem because my flight instructor has to be back and in, in at Charleston International at noon so um, morning <laughs> All right, we made it to, we made it back. Got Lee, he was sleeping. What's up, Chris? What's up? All fueled up, and I'm not gonna be filming on the way there because we're in a rush and we're gonna focus, so. Cut to Conway. So we're here pre-flighting November 17048 and on the ramp there's a crawfish which makes zero sense because we're at an airport <laughs> and these guys don't fly. So let's save his life, Lee. I'm trying. Ah! I gotta grab my pie. Oh, he doesn't like me. Oh, he's got little pinchers. He's gonna fucking kill me. Save his life. <laughs> he got little pinchers. <laughs> well, I can't lob him over the fence. It's not, it's not, it's not dying of well, the grass. Okay, I'll lob him. He's. His terminal velocity is low enough he should survive this. Don't hate me, YouTube. Oh yeah, landed in soft grass by the water. We did a good thing. So I'm gonna go around it to the north, turning heading uh, 230 for a minute. Okay, I still got you on ADSB. Um, I see you back there. I'm, I'm slowed down now, showing 76 knots. Um, hopefully you catch up soon. Roger that. We got uh, 86 knot ground speed, 87. Uh, okay, yeah, 85. You're trying to load up some warm, do some more turns. Say it again, Lee. I just said I'm gonna try and load up some more. I got about the same ground speed as you do right now. Uh, we're up to 94 an hour. We're uh, we're getting up there. I got uh, two knots of flapped out and I'm full way back trying to slow it down. I should have waited until you guys climbed up. I think that's what really changed this. I don't think your ground speed's all that different than the climb. Yeah, we were climbing like pigs, man. Full fuel, two guys in gear. It was rough. Yeah. Is this thing low on? Tommy, still got me in the poop. 
Roger that. I think if you do a 360, we should be right up next to you, but you're, uh, you're crossing perpendicular to us now. Yeah, okay, I'll do, a, I'll do a quick turn here. This is fucking fun, bro. Oh, yeah. All right, to get back on course, we need about a 2 4 zero. Okay, yeah, I was avoiding that cloud. We were right on it. Okay. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, I'm going to have to... Keep the yard, though. Yeah, that'll, that's fine. Roger that. About like this. I don't know where he is. It's hard to tell with the damn clouds. Um, he was just getting real close. Hey, you guys are at 45, correct? Okay, tell him uh, he, he should, should be, be uh, opposite direction. Oh, I, see you. I don't see him. Give us your position, Lee. I'm direct off your left wing, high. Roger that, we got you. Ooh. And then uh, Lee will let you line up off our right wing tip. Roger that. Yeah, so in your scan, just every now and again, make sure you check these also, your oil temp, oil pressure, uh, that the air meter's reading a positive charge. I feel like we're going to repair throwing out flaps. He's throwing out the flaps, though, yeah. he said. Sorry, buddy. I'll get a faster plane next time. <laughs> um, grab, grab the cruise checklist. Make sure we've done everything on the cruise checklist. Good. Okay, cruise power 2000 to 2750. We're good there. Uh, elevator trim adjusted. Mixture is leaned. That is it. Yep, okay. Uh, that's stupid, though, because it should have lights on there, too. I think the checklists I bought are, are a little bit better. Okay. Yeah, that would be good. I should have done that. You guys are... Uh, quick in the hole. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got a nice little corridor here through the clouds. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. I'm straight behind you. I, I see you. I'm just trying to close the gap. I'm looking for you in my rear view mirror. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. Look behind us. I don't know. Turn around and look. Oh, that is cool. Let's see if I can get that. We got a visual on you, Lee, through the back window. It's pretty cool. Uh, wing rock. So give me, uh, we're getting off course a little bit. Give me about 240. All right, they're going to make a light right turn here to uh, about 230 to avoid these clouds. Yeah, no credit. Whatever you do, I'm doing. I, I got it. Good okay. fight on. Yeah, two four zero. Yeah, but look at. Oh, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> I got gotcha. you. I have to go around. Maybe we can cut through here. We'll see. Yeah. This thing's got to go here. What is that? It's a phone holder. But it's in my way. <laughs> well, I was nervous about this, Chris. I was wondering how she would do. Uh, you know. Doing great. Long period, but it's fine. Great. I don't yeah. like this little looseness here, but I don't think anything can do about that. That's in, that's behind. Here we go. I'll go two four zero. Yeah, dude, with you coming up to the sides and back of us like that, I almost feel like you're creeping around, like you're hiding in the bushes, peeping at us. <laughs> diggy, diggy. <laughs> Creepy Uncle Lee. I was gonna go with Top Gun, but you know whatever. If we if we want to creep in the bushes, it's fine. Dude. <laughs> we going to the right of it? Or the left? Uh, we're deciding. Give me a sec. Right. How are we going to go to the right of it? All right. Yeah, that gives us 110. 103 ground speed. Ah! Oh, yeah. Cruising. This is what you have to, if you're at Charleston or somewhere and they tell you max forward speed, you can do this. In smooth air, you can operate into the yellow arc. Okay. It is smooth at the moment. I just would, I would recommend never going above uh, 150. You don't, you don't want to run it that close. Yeah, yeah. And Lee, do you have a visual on us? Yep, directly behind. Okay. Glad that we got you. Alright guys, well I'm not going to bore you with the rest of the flight back, but we did get some pretty fun formation flying in on the way back, got some cool pictures of one another and some video. All in all, this ended up being an awesome first flight, and I promise future videos will have better audio and better video. I'm still getting it all figured out right now.
All right, guys, well, I am a sweaty mess, but um, we got to Somerville. We did not make it all the way to the airport we needed to go to um, where I'm having the work done. I got to have ADSB installed on this airplane behind me here, and um, I got to get it to Walterboro. But we were too pressed for time today because Lee slept in, um, but we did get the plane to Somerville. So this will actually be the home base of my airplane. This is where it'll stay. Um, and the good news is I don't need someone to fly me to the plane now. I can drive here and have someone pick me up from the airport it's got to go to because it's so close by. So I won't need, um, I won't need shuttling or anything like that, which is nice. Um, but successful flight. Everything ran great. This is the first semi-cross country we went on about 94 miles or probably a little bit less because we didn't go all the way. But uh, I'll say 80 miles, something like that. Flew great. Got to fly. Um, a little bit of formation up there with Lee. So cool. We weaved clouds the whole way. Um, but yeah, uh. I mean, this is amazing that the plane flew great. I can't wait to get up there and get, get some actual lessons in and learn and uh, get through my private pilot certificate, man. I just can't wait to fly. That was a lot of fun flying with somebody up there. And, uh, it's going to be great when we can just call each other, my buddy Lee and I, and be like, hey, let's go to lunch on St. Simon's Island or something, and uh, we'll be able to do that. So I'm going to leave this one here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, all that jazz, and uh, see you guys later. Peace. Uh -huh.